And the sun is setting on a breezy and cool day across eastern Oklahoma, although we did see plenty of sunshine. Our Comfort Solutions Renaissance Hotel Cam as we're looking off to the west. And we are seeing mainly clear skies, just a couple of clouds here and there. But as we move through the evening and overnight, the clouds will start to increase across eastern Oklahoma. And it is starting to cool off as well. We're at 47 degrees, so if you were outside for an extended period of time, not so bad if you were in the sunshine, but if you were in the shade, it was a little bit on the chilly side thanks to those gusty west winds. Right now we have a northwest wind at 10 miles per hour. Here's a look at temperatures area wide. We're already down to 41 in Coffeeville, 43 in Grove and Bartlesville. We're sitting in the upper 40s here in the city, 49 in Stigler, and still at 50 degrees. Fort Smith, Poto also over in Seminole. Winds relatively light from Tulsa to the south. We're just seeing that light wind uh, down around Okmulgee, also into southeast areas of Oklahoma. Winds at about 5 to 10 miles per hour here in northeast Oklahoma. We are seeing winds still at 14 miles per hour up in Coffeeville. So winds will stay up at around 10 miles per hour through the evening hours. So not terribly strong, but as temperatures continue to drop off. Any breeze at all will make it feel colder than that actual temperature. We're still at 54 in Little Rock, mid to upper 50s in northern areas of Texas, but you notice to the north we are seeing colder temperatures only in the 30s in Kansas and most of Missouri, and those colder temperatures are going to work their way in for the overnight. We're going to start off tomorrow morning below freezing, and then temperatures tomorrow afternoon running about 10 to 15 degrees colder than where we were this afternoon, so it will be a chilly day on our Monday. All right, let's take a look at future track. As we move through the rest of the evening and overnight hours, we'll see clear departure the cloudy skies from Tulsa up to around the Oklahoma Kansas line, mainly clear skies to the south. More cloud cover as expected up in areas of southern Kansas. As I put this into motion through the rest of the evening and overnight, we'll see partly cloudy skies around the area through the evening. Thicker clouds again to the north, but overnight tonight we will see the clouds start to increase. And by morning, we'll see mostly cloudy skies here in northeast Oklahoma and southeast Kansas. Maybe a few additional breaks in parts of southeastern Oklahoma. So we will start off with some clouds tomorrow morning here in Tulsa. We'll keep the clouds going probably till the midday or early afternoon. Then they'll start to break and some additional sunshine returning, especially into the afternoon hours. So becoming partly cloudy tomorrow. We will see north winds tomorrow at about 10 miles per hour. And temperatures are going to start off chilly tomorrow morning, generally in the upper 20s to lower 30s, about 29 in Tulsa and Bartlesville, 31 in Muskogee and Stigler. And we'll see those wind chills close to 20 degrees tomorrow morning. As we move through the afternoon with a little bit of afternoon sunshine, only up to about 40 here in Tulsa, upper 30s to the north, slightly warmer to the south, low to mid 40s as you move into southeast Oklahoma. And you notice those temperatures running about 10 to 15 degrees below average. All right, a lot of folks are wondering about the end of next week. We're talking about the potential for some wintry weather as we walk through it Friday at noon. So again, remember, this is still five days out, but this is the first look at what we're expecting. By noontime on Friday, we could see some showers, maybe a light wintry mix developing here in eastern Oklahoma, chance of snow out in northwestern Oklahoma and the Panhandle. As we move through the afternoon hours on Friday, you notice we'll see the potential for a wintry mix here in northeast Oklahoma, mainly a cold rain down to the south, better chance for winter weather out to the west. As we move through the evening and overnight on Friday night into early Saturday morning, a winter mix will continue across parts of northeast Oklahoma, better chance of snow out west. But as we move on through the day on Saturday, as colder air continues to filter in a better chance for light snow on Saturday. So it looks like a wintry mix possible on Friday, a chance for some light snow across the area on Saturday, but still several days. We're going to be keeping an eye on this as we move a little bit closer in the next few days, though. Just cool with highs in the lower 40s, and you notice plenty of sunshine for Monday and Tuesday. Warmer on Wednesday, slight chance of showers Thursday, and then that chance for some wintry weather coming in by the end of the week. Ooh, I hope. Get ready for it. I'm kind of excited for it, right? Something else.